robbery in Lawrenceville leaves one crook in jail and police searching for two more. And the thieves didn't even get away with anything. This robbery happened at a Wells Fargo branch on December 28th. CBS Atlanta's Steve Kiggins just finished talking with police who want you to take a good look at the guys who got away. Cops say the crooks showed up in two vehicles and they caught up with one of them, but two of those suspects are still on the loose, and so is their getaway car. Take a look at what surveillance cameras caught at this Lawrenceville Wells Fargo bank branch last week. You can see two armed suspects barge in and present a bag for tellers to fill with cash. The two got the loot and ran out of the store, but Gwinnett County Police soon caught up with one of those suspects. They left inside the car all the money that they had stolen and the pistol and the shotgun that were used in the robbery. Police caught this man, Jamar Terrell, after a short chase. Police interviewed and charged him with aggravated assault and armed robbery. But investigators believe his two partners are also responsible for the robbery. Gwinnett County Police are now on the hunt for these two men, Thomas Birdsong and Marcus Rudledge. We would recommend that people consider him armed and dangerous. We don't know if we got all of their guns in the car or not. Police think a car like this 1992 Honda Accord is what they used in their getaway. Now if you can recognize either of those two suspects that are still on the loose, you're urged to call Crime Stoppers at 404-577-TIPS. Reporting in Lawrenceville in Gwinnett County, Steve Kiggins, CBS.